Hello, my name's Steph and I normally work in Melksham Library and this week to celebrate National Libraries Week we are sharing some of our favourite books from the last few months and today I'm going to talk about The Girl with the Louding Voice by Abby Dare published by Scepter which is an imprint of Hodder and Stoughton. This book centres around a young girl, a dunny, who lives in Nigeria in a poor village. She's 14 year old in the book and it's her journey of life from the poor village into wealthy Lagos. And it very much is a, a story which shows the haves and the have nots in Nigeria. Uh, the book starts, her mother's sadly died, um, but her mother is with her um, throughout the book um, with her love and her inspiration. And one thing her mother always instilled into Adani was the importance of education and how getting educated was a way of finding your voice. Hence the title, The Girl with the Louding Voice. So as a motherless um, um, daughter, um, her father is broke and so he sells her um, to be the third wife of an old man who's desperate to have a son. His first two wives have only had daughters. Um, she does befriend the second wife, but sadly tragedy soon strikes and she flees her husband and ends up being trafficked and um, finds herself working as a housemaid in a wealthy family in Lagos. But sadly, her boss, Big Madam, regularly beats her up and Adani also lives under the threat that she might be abused by Big Daddy, the man of the house. Despite this, she holds on to the hope that she will um, get out of this and that the next day will be better. And she does have access to the house library where a number of books that she does um, read um, as a way of getting her education, including a, a book on uh, facts about Nigeria. It is set in recent times, in about 2015, 2016. So it is very recent and it's a story of some of the hardships and the horrors that some of the young girls, particularly poor girls, find living in Nigeria. I won't say what the ending is, but um, Adani lives for the hope that she will through education, find her voice. And by doing so, she aspires to be a teacher who sets up her own school and can then help other girls in similar poor situations as herself. I've only just finished this book today and I absolutely loved it. It was great, and especially as it got to the end. It just really you know, wanted to find out how is this going to turn out? So it was really gripping at the end. I hope you enjoyed this review. If you're already a library member and would like to read this book yourself, you can reserve it. Um, just visit our website, www.wiltshire.gov.uk forward slash libraries and follow the instructions. If you're not already a member, you can join online for free again. Just visit our web pages for more information. I hope you like this review. Do look out for our other reviews this week. And if you want to hear more book reviews, do check out Wiltshire Library's YouTube channel. Thanks very much for listening and have a good rest of the day.